on the heavy rain and preparations for possible flooding overnight. Ashley Grams joins us live in downtown Portland. Ashley, give us the latest. Tim, we are seeing some light showers right now in the metro area, although it's been a pretty dry day in comparison to the last few, as Joe said, going to expect this to pick up here in the next few hours. Uh, Clackamas County and Portland have both opened sandbag locations in preparation for this localized flooding. Now, the National Weather Service is expecting low lying areas to start flooding here in the next few days. That could definitely impact roadways. Peabot says an additional 30 employees are working this weekend. They'll be clearing storm drains and they're ready to respond to any high water. But the Bureau of Transportation also has their eye on the Cascades, which are seeing some really heavy snow. So what we're concerned about is if if we get snow in the Cascades and then uh, followed by warming on on Sunday, uh, what does that mean in terms of a snow melt uh, in the Monday, Tuesday time frame? So does the snow melt add to the rain in the Portland area to start to cause some additional concern? The National Weather Service has issued an avalanche warning for Mount Hood because they expect temperatures to warm up so fast and that's going to last through tomorrow night. So if you are crossing the pass, if you're spending any time on the mountain at all, be aware, be cautious because conditions can change so quickly. Tim. Good advice. Thanks, Ash.